Hey everybody, Chris here again. Uh, I'm going to do a little video showing some of the goodies I just got in for the uh, the 1022 Ruger 1022 takedown I showed you guys last week. Uh, got all this, well, I got most of this stuff from Brownells, and um, what I got was uh, an aftermarket mag release, just extended. Got some, see if you can get in there and see it in the package with got some nice uh, serrations on there make it easier to push um, auto bolt release which is in my opinion just about a must-have for the 1022 rifle um, and then this little beauty which is a uh, titanium aftermarket charging handle and all three of these items are made by a company called power custom and I'll try to give you a shot of the website right there and I'll put a link uh, down below in the descriptions uh, to their company's website but uh, these aren't exactly cheap uh, especially this guy this guy's about 67 bucks or so um, but it does offer up a few things I think uh, a lot of other aftermarket charging handles don't uh, for one thing um, I've used several of their products and charging handles before and I've never had an issue uh, other companies you can get you can have problems because either they look cool, but they're too heavy, so they slow the bolt down to where uh, you have some cycling issues, or the spring's too heavy. Um, this one right here, those titanium, it's just about the right weight, and um, I can zoom in here. So that little pin is what holds the is what holds the uh, spring onto the uh, charging handle. And when you put this in your rifle, you take that out. But uh, this is this is a great advantage over the stock Ruger charging handles because on the Ruger charging handles the spring is just the spring guide rod goes up and it's just crimped down at the at the uh, top here so your spring ever goes out you got to buy a whole new charging handle this you can just uh, buy new springs and replace it. in fact I ordered a couple to go with it when I ordered this uh, they're like four dollars a piece so great investment um, really great really great uh, high quality products I like all their stuff I really do but the main thing and uh, I want to say uh, thanks to dude over at the 80s podcast channel for turning me on to this. Um, I'm going to get I'm going to get a full uh, full blown shout out out to you here pretty soon. But um, what's in this little box is, believe it or not, a stock. Yep, that's right. Well, a stock and a little something else. This is the AGP products. Um, stock for the Ruger 1022 takedown and uh, your uh, factory end just you know you mount the receiver and the factory end just goes on there you've got a whole you've got a nice folding stock here um, I had this out earlier and was kind of playing around with it a little bit man this thing is super super high quality the plastic is uh, nice and thick unlike uh, some of the other some of the other products out there <coughs> Butler Creek excuse me um, I can't bend this in any way shape or form or squish it it's nice and rigid man um, the folding stock it locks up just like a bank ball man I mean this thing is tight there's no there's no wobble in this at all uh, it's got a push button release doesn't lock in the open position uh, I don't think that's a huge handicap, but but uh, thanks, dude, for bringing this to my attention, man. This is a super high quality product. Really like it, and uh, I'll get a video up of this once I get it, all these things uh, on the rifle and let you take a look at them. So uh, everybody have a great night and an even greater weekend.